Good morning. No. Yes. Still. Um, how are you? I hope all is good. Um, and I am feeling fairly upbeat because today I'm going home. <laughs> I have been away for ten days, so I'm now sitting in the um, the lounge at Heathrow, peering out over one of the runways um, and I am heading home to my darling darling husband Mikey who has probably been thrilled he's had 10 days of peace and quiet but anyway I'm about to go and change all that for him bless him and um, I'm looking forward to getting home to my sanctuary so that's that's quite nice so anyway I'm feeling positive today and I hope you are too and um, if you are hurrah um, you'll probably get a little bit from this and if you're feeling less positive you'll get more from this today so it's all about our, our inner critic what's this little boy doing in your head and are you paying it attention or not or are you batting it into the long grass that's the question so my name's Kai Graham my company is the mind model and every day I try and bring some positivity some um, bit of perspective and a bit of light-hearted humor sometimes not always to the internet uh, to the mind model tribe so welcome and today's quote um, is every time a negative thought comes into your head then change your perspective so what's going on is, have you got sort of negativity or is there a little voice that you need to, to get rid of so here is uh, here's a couple of things um, maybe you're just sort of doing that mm, I can't do that oh I'm not very good at that so do me a favor and put the word yet on the end I had a lot of that last week. I can't do this. I'm rubbish at that because I was doing public speaking. Um, and by putting yet on the end, it gives you permission not to be fantastic. It gives you permission to trip and fall a bit and, and it takes the pressure off. So that's cool. That's, I mean, that's a good thing. But maybe, maybe it's not achieving something. Maybe someone's getting under your skin. Maybe someone annoys you or someone at work or someone in your circle or whatever it is and they're driving you mad. Well, just take them out of the equation and have a think, what is it that they're triggering? What is it within you that makes it their behavior so annoying? Um, because it'll probably be something that you don't quite want to face up to. I have people in my circle and I think, oh God, that's right. And then I sort of suddenly realize, oh, okay, it's something, something about me, actually, nothing to do about them. So maybe reframe that. In NLP, we call it reframing, and it just means give it a different perspective. Um, I, I will put in the comments a link uh, to this, because it's quite a good little technique. And um, it's just a free PDF you can download, and, and, and that might be able to help you. But it's, um, you know, it's just sort of changing, changing what that voice is saying in your head um, it's a bit like having the devil and the angel it's no you can't yes you can and it's all that sort of stuff and it's just just try and reframe it and just give yourself um, a little bit of space and a little bit of a chance to not always get things perfectly right but just to move on and and take that take that negativity out of the day you know sometimes we sort of say, oh God, I've just had a crap day. And actually it wasn't a crap day. It might have been one comment that sort of turned, turned you on, on, on the axis. Or maybe it was just a bad hour. Or maybe just, you know, but it's not the whole day that's bad. So um, have a little bit. I tell you it was a good, a good tip is, but at the end of the day, um, look back over the day and give yourself five things that you were grateful for I'm not I'm not interested in the less the, you know the, the the negative look at the five things that you were grateful for because what that does is it puts your mind to, to bed on a positive thought which works brilliantly because you know it, it's got a long time to think about it when you're asleep so that that gratitude at the end of the day works really really well so have a think about that um, yeah that, that's all it was just a, just a couple of hints and tips to help you get over that inner critic that we all have so you're not on your own if you've got it but I tell you what if we can start silencing it and keeping it sort of quieter let's let's get the let's get the little angels singing louder than the little devil in our ear how does that sound so thank you for the shares thank you for the comments I really appreciate them um, and it just sort of spreads the word a little further. And in the meantime, have a good day. Um, I'm heading home. Woohoo! And um, I shall see you all tomorrow. All right then. Thank you. Bye bye.